Using only a few AI tech tools for content creation, I was able to build a full YouTube video that is ready for upload and I completed this task as quickly as I could. Three AI content creation tools were all I used. ChatGPT, Murph AI, and the FlexClip Online Video Editor. The very first step in creating content for any platform is selecting a topic for your video. You're going to conduct your research using some free AI tools since they are readily available. I want to create a video about the future of blockchain technology and cryptocurrencies like Bitcoin. To create the script for my video, I'll use ChatGPT. I'm going to ask ChatGPT to write a brief script for a YouTube video on my topic. I requested a brief script because I really don't want ChatGPT3 to generate the entire script for the YouTube video. I want to have a lot of control over the final outcome. I'll evaluate the results and then conduct more research on some of the ideas it has produced. I'll write a unique script for my video in this manner. Keep in mind that ChatGPT isn't perfect and that you won't just copy and paste the results, rather, you'll use the script as a starting point to build your own video script. The only thing you need to do when ChatGPT3 generates an output is read it, then ask follow-up questions based on what it contains to gain more information. As you can see, I'm requesting more in-depth explanations of a few of the concepts and phrases that it generated for the video script. I'll also inquire about a few important details that I believe I should cover in the video. The ideal method to use ChatGPT as a research tool is in this manner. Once your research is complete and you are satisfied with the results, you can simply copy and paste the results into your word processor or text editor. For additional tweaking, I will copy and paste these outputs into my Google Docs. I'll read through the entire document, strike out a few phrases, add a few details, and arrange the language as effectively as I can for a YouTube video. The next step after finishing your writing is to create an audio voiceover. Any of the three approaches can be used in this situation. If you have the necessary tools, the best option is to record your own voiceover. Another excellent choice is to hire a freelancer to record a voiceover for you. As an alternative, you can create the voiceover from the text, using a good AI text-to-speech program. It's still a decent alternative even though some creators might not feel comfortable with an AI text-to-speech software. As long as the quality of your voiceover is decent, it doesn't matter how you decide to create it, you'll get the desired outcomes. To create my voiceover, I'm going to use Murph AI Studios. I'll start out by going to the Murph AI Studio and starting a new project. The use case will be my selection for the video project. The next step is to listen to voice samples and select an appropriate voice for my video content. Once the voiceover sounds good enough to move on to the next phase, I'll put my text into the editor and make a few edits to it. I'll then build the full audio and export the finished product. It's time to edit the video, now that my audio file is ready. This part of the video was sponsored by FlexClip. The FlexClip online video editor is a really advanced video editor. FlexClip is a powerful online video maker which can create videos easily and quickly even for beginners. You get access to millions of royalty-free stock media including photos, videos, and music. You can also use FlexClip for screen recording. The best part is that its interface is similar to most traditional video editing softwares. Additionally, it is cloud-hosted, offering free cloud storage for your projects, which significantly reduces the workload and demands on your PC. Additionally, you will have access to 3,000 beautifully designed templates in various categories. To be notified whenever we post the full tutorial guide on how to use the Flex Clip Editor to edit videos for your YouTube channel, please make sure you are subscribed to this channel. This is the FlexClip Online Video Editor. I'm starting a new project from scratch. I have the option of using the Timeline Mode or the Storyboard Mode, both of which can be utilized by both amateurs and experts. I like the Timeline Mode because it is most similar to a conventional video editor, which I am extremely familiar with. I'll be brought to the project editing interface. I'm first use the media section, where I can import the voiceover file I already made with the Murph AI Studios. I'll click to upload the file after selecting it from my PC. The next step is to add this audio file to the timeline, and then add other scenes by simply clicking the plus button on the timeline. I'll just hop over to the stock videos section and look for appropriate stock videos that go along with the voiceover. Since the entire focus of the video is cryptocurrency, I'll simply enter the term into the search field and add any videos that would be most appropriate for the voiceover and content. In order for the scenes to flow with the speech, I will split them accordingly. As you can see, I'm currently doing just this. Although the video editing process can take some time, it would also depend on you. 
If you have the necessary skills and experience, you'll be able to work quickly and effectively. To enhance the overall quality of the video editing, I'll also include transitions between the segments. I can also use text graphics, sound effects, and visual effects, but I chose to keep it simple for the sake of this presentation. I'll have created a comprehensive tutorial video on how to utilize the Flex Clip Online Video Editor depending on when you may be watching this video, so check in the video description to find the full video tutorial. This is a preview of the video project with transitions, and I think it's looking good enough for a YouTube video. And why are they gaining so much attention? Cryptocurrencies are digital or virtual currencies that use cryptography for secure financial transactions. They operate on a decentralized network called the blockchain, which is a distributed ledger that records all transactions. So I'm going to add some background music to the video as my next step. I'll head over to the audio section and look for background music that relates to technology. A tech background music would suit this video content. I'll reduce the volume in order to prevent the actual voiceover from being drowned out by the background music. This is another preview of the video with background music included. Cryptocurrencies like Bitcoin. But what exactly are cryptocurrencies and why are they gaining so much attention? Cryptocurrencies are digital or virtual currencies that use cryptography for secure financial I'm going to export this video because I'm satisfied with the results. This is the final result, and I believe it's suitable for YouTube. Growth in the popularity and adoption of cryptocurrencies like Bitcoin. But what exactly are cryptocurrencies and why are they gaining so much attention? Cryptocurrencies are digital or virtual currencies that use cryptography for secure financial transactions. They operate on a decentralized network called the blockchain, which is a distributed ledger that records all transactions. This means that transactions are recorded and verified. Even while most YouTube videos don't even have this level of video editing, they nonetheless manage to attract a large number of views, simply because of the quality of the information and the content. Check out this suggested video to learn more about AI technologies and how to utilize them to generate content for YouTube. And let me know what you think about this video in the comments section below. I really appreciate your time, and I hope to see you in the next video. Thanks for watching till the end.